Hey everybody, it's Paige and welcome to Vlogmas Day 18. Today's video is going to be part three to my reorganizing my entire makeup room. So if you guys have missed part one and part two, I will link them down below. I've done my hair care and my body care. Now I think, well, my skincare isn't too big of a problem since I just did a skincare declutter, but I might just kind of go through that one more time, but I'm not gonna take everything out. But I am going to take everything off of the top of here and reorganize it, dust it. These boxes have been sitting here since I moved in, so they are kind of covered in dust and like probably setting powder. So I need to clean all of that off and then we will start moving on to the makeup drawers. This is a big pile of stuff that I am decluttering. And yeah, I guess if you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy, and let's go ahead and get started. I thought I would do a giveaway in today's video, so if you want to enter the giveaway, make sure you guys check the description box to see how to enter to win. This is the box of stuff that I'm going to be giving away. There's a bunch of different things in here. We have a Juno & Co sponge, some Revlon lippies. There is a Benefit foundation stick in here. It's in the shade five. If this isn't your shade, that's okay. You can totally just pass it along to somebody else. Um, we have some fun little like samples and things. I also have this brush set from LA Colors. And then we have this Amika little fun hair coloring set, some Ula Henriksen, Glow Alchemist. There's a Glam Glow moisturizer in there and just a bunch of fun, different sort of random things. So if you guys want to enter this giveaway, don't forget to check out the description box. Okay guys, this is looking so much better. I just took everything off. I wiped everything down. You guys saw how dusty it was. I actually didn't put everything back because I felt like it was just a little bit too crowded. So I have a little bit of a mess to deal with here now. Um, this lamp, I don't know, like I don't have a place for this lamp. It's been sitting up here since we moved in and I don't even know why. Um, I have some really pretty pieces like this little Chanel inspired rose heart um, that was gifted to me by Lay Fifi Lovely Gifts. She made me this and then she also made me that bear in the corner. I highly recommend you guys go check out her Instagram. Her stuff is so cute. Um, and then I have like my PR box with bling brushes which I actually want to put somewhere else. I don't know. I just feel like it got kind of lost in all of this. So. I was thinking of maybe doing like a little shelf over here and putting it on that. I don't know, I just wanna find a better way to display it instead of just like plopping it on top of the Chanel box, but this is so much better, I'm so excited. Now, I gotta figure out what to do next. I guess I'm just going to double check this third unit, which is the skincare unit. I'll show you guys drawer by drawer, I'll just show you what's in there. Uh, but I did just do a declutter like I mentioned earlier, and then I guess we'll just move on to the next one, which has a bunch of makeup in it. So 
and other things I don't I don't know that that this unit right here is kind of random so we'll see what happens okay I am back I took a little bit of a break just because I needed to like sit down because I was getting kind of hot so anyway <laughs> I cleaned up my workspace a little bit I have this pile of makeup that I have to go through and sort of put away I think I'm just going to like put it in the drawer that it belongs but like I mentioned I'm going to take everything out again so I don't know if there's even really a point to that I don't know we'll figure this pile of stuff out but I moved all of the products that I am getting rid of um, from over here and I brought them over here I put them in this box so this is a declutter pile I'm gonna go through it most of this stuff can be passed along either donated or given to friends and family if it's like used but um, for the most part like hair products and stuff um, are unused and can be donated so I have this huge box and then I have this box which I also have to go through and figure out like what is still good there's definitely some old expired lip products in there so some stuff I will have to dispose of unfortunately but for the most part this will be going to you know new homes so I did that um, now oh I love the way that things are looking up here like it's just so clean and exciting so um, I'll show you my skincare unit um, this first drawers cleansers now I will say that I filmed a skincare declutter and I may have actually taken like a couple products that I said I was going to declutter and put them back even though I literally never do that like I very rarely do that people speculate that I do that all the time but really I don't but there were a couple of things after posting my video so many people said that this is an amazing cleanser so I was like okay you know what I need to try it so that's my cleanser drawer this is like makeup removers and um toners and cleansing balms which I go through like crazy then this drawer is my moisturizer drawer next we have um, serums that are like in bottles then this one is other serums that are also in bottles I guess these ones are like in the droppers which I would like to not store them on their side like that but they're too tall to stand up unfortunately um, so this is like other like serums and treatments. I have an SPF in here and Then in this drawer I have sheet masks and like my peace out acne little Healing dots these things are amazing. I love them so much um, Then we've got masks in here and then this drawer is like extras which this is where I added like I think I decluttered this and then I like put it back um and then this bottom drawer I didn't like declutter but I just have like a ton of Billy razors which I actually need to cancel my subscription because obviously I do not shave my legs as much as um, I am purchasing those things so <laughs> anyway that's my skincare unit it's pretty good I don't think I'm going to mess with that but now we have this drawer unit so this is kind of random um this has reusable cotton pads and scrunchies and like these little makeup eraser things that's what i have in here which i don't know if i want this in here because it's kind of like i don't know i might do something else with this drawer then we have this drawer which just has some like i don't know like halloween not halloween makeup but this is like a paint like face paint basically and same with this it's like this big palette um, which I don't really do a ton of makeup like that here I just have some like more Halloween ish type things like a lot of these are like Halloween lashes and then my Colourpop glitters and more little like face paint type things and then I have some empty like magnetic palettes then oh my god oh my god <laughs> I don't think I've shown anybody this video or this drawer. I definitely need to go through this drawer. I have so many duplicates of Benefit products. So, yes. These are all brand new. Like, literally brand new. So, I do need to go through this because, I mean, I love Benefit products. But I don't need this many. This is like hoarding. Um, 
here I have my first face palette drawer, which I just did a face palette declutter, so that is one of them. This is another one. Oh my god. You scared the crap out of me. Wow, well, anyway, um, <laughs> this is my second face palette drawer, which once again, I just redid this, but those probably won't stay where they're at. Like, I, I'm probably gonna, like, like, my foundation drawer's over here. I might move it over here or, like, opposite. I don't know. We'll see. Everything's gonna come out and get reorganized. I might, like, draw on a piece of paper, like, how I plan on doing it just to, like, you know, have a plan. Here I have makeup cleaning stuff. Um, I have a ton of this Liquid Beauty Blender Cleanser, which normally I use the solid, and then the Cinema Secrets is amazing. This drawer is my makeup remover, makeup, uh, makeup wipe drawer, which you guys, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I know makeup wipes are not good. Um, I've, I can't tell you the last time that I purchased, like, these like I've had these wipes for so long I bought like a big box at Costco and I'm not gonna lie I still do use them sometimes but I really try my best to not use them um but that's why I like I pretty much fully transitioned over to reusable um cotton pads or makeup erasers um cleansing balms that kind of thing but I still do have some makeup wipes and I'm not just gonna throw them away because that would be just as wasteful. So yeah, makeup wipes, and then this bottom drawer is actually empty. This is where I normally keep my products that I'm going to give away, but they're actually pretty much all over here. I'm gonna start fresh with my giveaway products just to make sure I'm keeping them, you know, cycled through. And when I get products sent to me from brands or I purchase things for giveaways, I usually just kind of keep them in here until it's time for a giveaway. So now I'm going to should I just take everything out? N there's no way I could do that. I think I'm gonna plan out the drawers, like the placement on a piece of paper, and then I'll come back to you and show you my plan. Okay, y'all, so I have a plan. This is sort of like, this is just a rough plan, and I still have some empty squares, but basically, each one of these is an Alex 9 drawer unit. There are five smaller drawers and then four larger ones, and I just kind of like labeled what I want in each drawer and I already have some empty drawers so I know that there will still be empty drawers so I might slightly shift things around and like leave room for you know possibly like expanding drawers that are like really crowded or something like that so here's the plan let's see if we can translate it into real life I actually think I'm gonna start over here because for the most part, these drawers are already where I want them, but I do need to go through all of the product and just kind of, you know, do a little decluttering, clean out the drawers, things like that. Okay, so here are my first four drawers emptied out. We have everything from brow products to mascaras to eye primers to tweezers to single shadows to pigments to glitters to literally anything remotely like that. So I'm going to speed through this. I'm going to reorganize everything. I'm going to possibly declutter some things and then we will organize things back into the drawers that they belong.
Alright guys, so I am in the middle of working on those first few drawers like I mentioned. I already pretty much went through everything. This is what I am getting rid of out of those drawers. There's quite a bit of stuff here. Um, I just did sort of like a quick run through. So this is what I'm kind of working on. I already have my brow products put back, but I realized I still have a ton of brow products over here. So yes, um, I'm going to go through this now and figure out what I want to keep and what I want to give away, what I will, you know, what I'm not keeping, I will put in that bottom drawer, which is going to be my giveaway drawer. And those will be featured in some upcoming giveaways, which I am so excited about. So I'm going to go through this now. Um, I already did my brow drawer, like I mentioned, and then I did my mascara, eye primer, lash glue, mini mascara, and like tweezers, lash applicators, you know, some more eye primers, that kind of drawer. So those two are done. Well, the brow drawer is like kind of done because I have to do the benefit one now, but I thought I would just go ahead and update you all. This drawer is empty now, and from here, these are all of the products that are either not my shade or duplicates that I don't need. And then these are the products that I'm tempted to keep. I'm gonna go through them like I don't need, um, you know, eight precisely my brow pencils, even though this is my favorite brow pencil. Um, but I just wanted to look at the descriptions of the shades because some of them are a little bit different. Um, but yeah, this is where we're at. Okay guys, I think I am at a stopping point for today. So basically I finished the top four drawers in here. I'll go ahead and show you. Here I have my brow products. I did put my extra benefit brow products in the back just because that is my most used brow product. And I thought that, you know, there's space back there so I might as well put them back there. But I have all of my like pencils and stuff here. I have some brow gels here little pomades, um, smaller brow gels. I have this Benefit palette, um, some more Benefit products. <laughs> Benefit is pretty much my favorite brow brand, if you couldn't tell. And then I have my little Patrick Ta like brow soap thing there. So that is my brow drawer. Then we've got this drawer, which has mascaras, primers, um, lash glues, more mascaras and tools and things like that. Next, we have this one, which has pigments and liners and things. So I have all of my Makeup A Murder pigments in here, a bunch of ColourPop pigments, some other brands, um, more pigments back here. I have some little, like, Natasha Denona shadows and Charlotte Tilbury and cream shadows and all kinds of different things. Um, there's some glitters back there. Then I have more pigments. I have some with Love Cosmetics. These are like their smaller palettes. I have some pressed pigments and pressed glitters. Um, I have my e.l.f. bite-sized eyeshadow palettes and then some potted gel liner type things and also some water activated liners. And then this drawer has cream, like lick or stick shadow type things. These little liquid glittery shadows. Um, some liquid liners and other liquid glittery eyeshadow topper things. And then here I have a bunch of singles. So some of them are cream. Some of them are like pressed, like pigment things. These ones are kind of like a gel te texture. And then I have some regular single shadows and like glittery toppers and stuff. So those are the four drawers that are successfully completed. And out of those four drawers... This is everything that I am getting rid of. And then the bottom drawers is where things are gonna kind of like switch around. So right now I have my lip balms in this drawer, which I actually just redid this drawer. So um, I did like a lip balm declutter, but I'm actually gonna move my lip balms, I think over here. So I don't know, there's gonna be some flip flopping and stuff and I'm gonna move my more Halloween type makeup into this drawer so I think I'll just say that for another day and then well I guess tomorrow and then here I have all of my lashes so I have like three oh my god someone just like yelled outside that scared me <laughs> three drawers of lashes and then I have a bunch of well pretty much all of my Jeffree Star Cosmetics lipsticks down here which I think I'm gonna put 
all of my Jeffree Star makeup in like those three drawers. I don't know. I've already like made revisions to my plan. So yeah, as you can see, I've already like scratched stuff out. But I think we did pretty good for today. I'm currently watching, um, oh frick, why did I do that? <laughs> um, I'm watching Kelly Strax PR haul and she literally mentioned my blinged brushes in them. So if you guys don't follow Kelly Strack, she's one of my favorite YouTubers. Um, I think she has almost a million subscribers and um, she's awesome. So yeah, definitely go check her out. I'll link her down below. I'll actually link this video down below so you can see her talk about my blinged brushes collaboration. So yeah, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Oh, by the way, these are all of the products that I'm adding to my giveaway drawer from Benefit, just the Benefit products. <laughs> These are all brand new, never been used, and yeah, super exciting. So anyway, if you guys enjoyed today's video, please don't forget to subscribe and give it a thumbs up. I love you guys so, so much. I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye.